It's all three isotopic energy masses. Electrochemical, temporal, and geothermic. They're gathering strength on their own planes of existence. That's what's bleeding through. But guys, I know this feels different. That's because it is. This is personal to them, which means it's not going to be an ordinary fight. We need to be ready for anything. Have you heard back from Cecile yet? Yeah, Joe said she was at Iron Heights and that it's important. She thinks she might know how her powers are leveling up, but she'll be here as soon as she can. Good. We're going to need all the meta power we can get. Mona, I don't have much time, so here's how it's going to go. I'm going to take those off. You're going to read my mind. Tell me what I'm thinking, if you can. With pleasure. Don't get any ideas, Mona. She's taking the cuffs off, but this is a meta interrogation cell. The walls are meta dampened, so you won't be able to read anything except us. Like I want to read that empty mind of yours. Watch it. For what? You're going to put me back in prison? Can we save it for the playground, ladies? And Mona, no tricks. Now, let's have some fun. What did you do to me? My telepathy's gone. Oh! Excuse me, somebody has a potty mouth. And no, Rosa, you are not the good cop in this situation. Because you stole her powers, too. What is it? Everyone, I can hear the entire city. All of their thoughts. An ordinary fight. Barry. We need to be ready for anything. Barry. We have to go. What the hell? Horton? No, no way. She said these walls were meta dampened. How can you read every single mind in town all at once? Even I couldn't do that. I don't know. I don't understand it either. I think I do. Look, I don't know how, but Horton. You're becoming one of the most powerful metas this city has ever seen. A planet, for that matter. What's happening to me? <laughs> 